a meditation for you during the time of the coronavirus COVID-19. It is based on Psalm 91, the Good News Translation. Hello, this is Rev. Dr. Gertie Loretta Hurley. The Bible says, be still and know that I'm God. With that in mind, I have prepared these words of inspiration and reflection for your quiet time with God. I call them love messages from God. The love messages are taken directly from God's Word. Proverbs chapter 17 verse 17 says that a friend loves at all times. God loves you, Jesus loves you, and I love you. As a friend, may I address you as anointed one? The words are taken from Psalm 91, the Good News Translation version of the Bible. Sit comfortably in your chair, feet flat on the floor. Let your shoulders relax. Place your hands on your legs, palms up. Now gently close your eyes and imagine that God is sitting in this big chair that stands high. Your eyes are still closed. Imagine God is picking you up and putting you in his lap. His comforting arms are holding you. Your eyes are still closed. Stop for a moment and visually let your mind see that. Breathe deeply. Inhale softly and exhale. Relax and listen to God spiritually through Psalm 91. I am God, your protector. When you come to me for safety and remain under my protection, know that I am your defender and protector. I am your God and you can put your trust in me. I will keep you safe from all hidden dangers and from all deadly diseases. I will cover you with my wings. You will be safe in my care. My faithfulness will protect and defend you. You don't have to fear any dangers at night or sudden attacks during the day or the plagues that strike in the dark or the evils that kill in daylight. A thousand may fall dead beside you, 10,000 all around you, but you will not be harmed. You will look and see how the wicked are punished, because you have made me as the Lord your defender, and you have made me as the Most High your protector. No disaster will strike you, and no violence will come near your home. I will put my angels in charge of you, to protect you wherever you go. They will hold you up with their hands to keep you from hurting your feet on the stones. You will trample down lions and snakes, furious, fierce lions and poisonous snakes. I said, I will save you because you have shown me that you love me and I will protect you because you have acknowledged me as Lord. When you call to me, I will answer you. When you call to me, I will answer you. When you're in trouble, I will be with you. I will rescue you and honor you. I will reward you with long life. I will save you. Amen, amen, amen. Now, anointed one, gently open your eyes and breathe deeply. Inhale softly and exhale. Slowly wake up and mentally descend from God's lap in his comforting arms. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we approach your throne, exalting you, praising you, and magnifying your name. Father, help your anointed one who has heard you speak through your scriptures to hide these words in a safe, spiritual place so they may be called at any time, at any place, and in any situation. 
Lord, let these words continue to inspire and enlighten your anointed one. Let these words also strengthen them so that they will embrace this love message from you. This we pray in the precious holy name of Jesus, our Savior and our Lord. Amen. 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 Anointed One, it has been my joy and pleasure to bring these words of inspiration and encouragement to you. It is my hope that you will continue to walk in divine wisdom, holiness, godliness, and love. May your spirit, soul, and body be kept healthy and faultless until our Lord Jesus Christ returns. Amen. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus.